Good morning and thank you for your inquiry on this beautiful 2014 Ford Explorer XLT. This XLT is going to be a fully loaded XLT. Wanted to just give you a quick walk around, show you the bells and whistles and really what sets this uh, XLT apart from all the other ones. So go ahead and drop right into it. As you can tell, you are going to have a very nice pair of Continental tires on it. 18 inch alloy wheels on it as well. Plenty of tread life left on those tires as you can tell. Uh, with this package of the XLT, you are going to have um, chrome little accent pieces, hints all over the place. So as you can tell at the very bottom, you are going to have the chrome skirts, you're going to have the chrome handles, and you're going to have that chrome-like roof rack. Come along to the front, you're going to have your turn signal indicators on your mirrors, a little Explorer symbol on your mirror as well. Come around up here, you are going to have automatically heated mirrors, as you can tell right there. You're going to have a blind spot monitoring mirror as well. The vehicle has a Nice pair of tinted windows on it as well. You do have your park sensors in the rear, as you can tell by those little dots. Got four in the rear. Do have a sporty dual exhaust on this vehicle as well as your tow hitch already installed. This is a definite plus. You do have backup camera on this vehicle as well. Power lift gate. As you can tell, you do have the third row with a bench seat in the middle. Um, good thing about that third row is that third row will not only lay flat, but it'll actually lay down in there um, really big thing that sets the uh, Explorer apart is your third rows typically don't have that big dent there I guess you would call it that inlay um, so not only like I said can you throw those in there but if you have to they actually have to use a third row you can throw some groceries down there or anything that you need to throw on down there easy down tailgate I said you have a nice pair of Continental tires, 18 inch wheels on it as well. Black leather throughout this vehicle is in really, really good shape as you can tell. You have your triple zone climate control controls in the back along with your cup holders and a 12 volt, I'm sorry, yeah, 12 volt outlet. Um, another thing that sets the Explorer apart is it doesn't have your typical AC units. You're actually going to have your AC unit in the roof, which is, uh, in my opinion, the best one you can get because you do have that uh, AC capability for all of your passengers, not just your uh, second row passengers. Another nice thing about it is you do have the security code system there too, so you can actually have your keys in your pocket or anything like that and just go up there, put in your code and unlock and lock all the doors for you. As you can tell, you do have auto up-down windows. You do have power mirrors and power locks. Power seats are going to be on this vehicle as well. Like I said, full, beautiful black leather throughout. Leather is in very, very good shape, as you can tell. Go ahead and hop on in, show you a couple more of the bells and whistles on it. So like I was saying, this is a pretty loaded XLT, so you are going to have your two driver infotainment systems. Left-hand side is going to tell you everything you need to know about the vehicle. So the display mode will show you RPMs, distance to E, things like that. Then you have your trip one, trip two, which will tell you mileage and everything. Fuel economy, pretty obvious. You're going to see your fuel economy. You can see um, your average fuel economy. You can see your instant fuel economy. And then at the very bottom, you can see your distance to E, as you can tell there. Driver assist, um, your park aid, your trailer sway, and your traction control. You can actually turn those on and off. And then settings just kind of make the vehicle your own. Right-hand side is going to control your entertainment, so your um, radio controls. You do have your compass on there. I'm not sure if anybody really uses that. And then you have your Bluetooth capability and your controls right there as well. Bluetooth controls are going to be at a touch of your finger right here, along with your radio volume and your radio channels. And then you have your cruise control options right there. 8-inch touchscreen radio comes with this vehicle as well. Like I said, you do have your Bluetooth connectivity there. Oop. You got your AM, FM radio with Sirius radio capability as well. My favorite part is going to be right here, your climate control settings. So instead of controlling everything from those buttons right there, you actually have a touch screen that does it for you. Um, so you do have your dual zone climate control, but not only that, but you do have heated seats on both of your front seats as well. Um, not below. Last but not least, like I said, you are going to have your park sensors and your backup camera. Not only are you going to have your backup camera on there, but this is a really nice, cool touch. A dotted line is actually going to be your line right to your trailer hitch. You have a magnifying glass up here. Press that. It'll zoom right into your trailer hitch, which is a definite plus if you're towing anything. You said you got your backup camera. Not only do you have your backup camera, but you have your park sensors as well as you can hear. Once they start going off, you can actually turn those on and off again if you want to. I'd always leave them on just for safety options, but you do have those controls as well. As you can tell, the closer I get to that Nissan, the uh, closer the intervals get. 
until they're solid. But like I said, thank you for your inquiry on this beautiful 2014 XLT Explore. Wanted to just do a quick video walk around for you. I ended up going a little over, um, but it did have a lot of bells and whistles with it. I wanted to make sure that you knew. Um, I know I missed a couple, but um, when you come on in here, take a look at it. I'll be sure to uh, go over everything with it. You do have some fog lights up front too. Um, give me a call at 734-765-8025 to schedule your appointment. Um, or if you need any other videos, pictures, or any other questions, feel free to reach out. Like I said, my name's Travis. Over at Florida Columbia, you can reach me at 734-765-8025. Thank you.